It's sunny and it's a beautiful day. The boys are doing great. The boys are doing so good. Nice one, bye. This view never gets old. In this video, I'm gonna showcase more family-friendly activities that you can do with your family when you visit Fernie in the fall. This is a third video of a three-part series sponsored by Tourism Fernie. I hope these videos give you and your family some ideas to do kid-friendly activities when you visit this beautiful, awesome town, Fernie, British Columbia. I hope you like this video. If you do, leave a thumbs up. And if you hit the subscribe button, that's a great way to support me as a creator and support the channel. Thanks for watching. Okay. You go you go ahead of me so I can film you. So this is cemetery bypass to what's up dock. Just You guys you guys are running it, not hiking it. You're right. We're going for a a hike, but Adi and Luca are starting off running. I don't think they're gonna be able to maintain that pace. Okay guys, we're gonna go up, what's up doc, right here. Hiking in the fall colors. The smell, the leaves, and just the morning light. It's so awesome. All right, so we got to the top of our hike in about half an hour. It's just shy of one and a half kilometers each way. So the total hike is three kilometers and it'll take probably just under an hour. Now that the kids are taking a break, having a snack, we might extend this to an hour and a half if we enjoy the forest. Just a reminder, to always Good practice to have bear spray on you if you are hiking the mountains around Fernie. Or, or biking, August said. Even if you're just doing a short, simple trail, having bear spray on you is a really good idea. And so is making noise. And with these guys, the noise is no problem. Right, Luca? Do you make noise? Do you make noise? Here we are at Fernie Golf Club. Beautiful morning to go golfing with the boys. Get that hair out of the way. Here you go, dude. There's your golf clubs. August, how do you find golfing? Huh? It's fun. <laughs> One of my first jobs I ever had when I was 14 years old was I was driving the, um, the range cart and I would pick up golf balls at my local golf course. It's still really cool to see my kids try all sports including golfing here at the Fernie Golf Club. All right, that was fun. Courtney and I are big at giving our kids, just introducing them to a wide range of activities and sports. Yeah. And so this was the first time the boys got to go golfing. We just went to the driving range and messed around on the putting green. And it was fun. You're gonna fill it? The last day to go golfing here at the Fernie Golf Club is the long weekend of the Thanksgiving, that Monday. 
is their closing day in the fall. But it's a great way to enjoy the fall colors and to see the mountain views that you get. I think that's one of the best parts about this course. After we worked up an appetite, we met Courtney and Adia at Big Bang Bagels. This is a popular spot to grab a bite to eat downtown. About to leave, already packing, come with me. Hey guys. I'm not really asking, we'll get away to a place where we don't know. We made it to the top of Montaigne Trail to the hut, to the cabin. This is a really iconic spot here in Fernie. You get all the views. Go, go, go. Get out of my hut. Get the hut. Get the hut. Yep. Okay, here he is. The accessibility trail, also called Montane Green, is a great option for inexperienced hikers or bikers. It's very attainable, it's not very steep. And that's an option, that's a great option for the descent, the ride down. We're gonna go down Montaigne Blue because our boys and Adia really enjoy going down some of these trails that they've experienced. It's sunny and it's a beautiful day. You guys are doing great. You did great. That was fun. Mm-hmm. Super fun. <laughs> Anyone can play no matter their skill set or ability, and it takes place in a beautiful outdoor setting. There it is! Huh, you gotta throw it forward! Okay, where's your Right there? That's the money shot. August, you're getting those drives down. Yeah. Disc golf in James Hi. White Park. <laughs> Great family activity. It's free, it's accessible. Just need a couple discs. If the weather's not on our side or the kids are just tired and need a break, visiting the Vogue Theater and experiencing a movie on the big screen is a kid favorite. Three o'clock on Saturday and Sunday afternoons, there's a matinee being shown at the Vogue Theater. The evening showing is at 7 p.m. every night of the week. And right now it's the Adams Family 2. That would be the more kid-friendly video.
You can book your public swim session online and this is a favorite for all of our kids. The Fernie RV Park provides a variety of camping options, including fully furnished yurts. This glamping style of camping makes for a comfortable and rustic experience. You can see through the The kids naturally enjoyed the playground, ordering pizza, and it only takes a few minutes to mm. visit Maiden Lake via the trail along the Elk River. Mm. Having a campfire, and experiencing the bunk beds in the yurt was also a kid favorite. This is the top bunk tonight. I didn't bring a book to read. Hey, yurt life. If you're planning a visit to Fernie, be sure to visit the Tourism Fernie website. That's a great resource and I will leave a link below down in the description. And if you have any questions about the activities I showcased in this video or any other activities and events and things to do in the Fernie area, please don't be shy and leave a comment down below. I'll do my best to get back and answer you in a timely manner. I hope you're getting outside, enjoying the natural world wherever you are. And if you're around Fernie, I hope to see you on the trails. Thanks for watching.